It's music to my ears. What's up, everybody? It's Adam for Rando Reviews, the channel that reviews anything and everything just for the fun of it. If you got a chance, make sure you hit that subscribe button below and then the little bell. That way you do not miss any of our episodes. Today, we're gonna to be talking about headphones. Now, you probably don't know this, but I love headphones. I spend so much money every single year on headphones, but here's the kicker. I don't ever buy the expensive headphones. For some reason, I would rather buy cheaper headphones from like the you know brands like Skull Candy, all the different Chinese brands you find on Amazon. You know, I have these little earbuds right here. I have these, I don't even know the, the brand name of these over the ear headphones I use. Um, I even got some Samsung Bluetooth headphones that are actually pretty good, but I, but I always wanna find better over the ear headphones. And that's what led me to these Taltronic active noise canceling wireless stereo headphones. Now when I'm looking for headphones, I'm wanting headphones that are cheap, that are comfortable, have good battery life with their Bluetooth and also sound good. So many reviews on YouTube, they do headphone reviews and they never talk about the sound quality or if they do, they talk about it at the very end. So pretty much if you're an audiophile like me, well, maybe a cheap audiophile like me, you want some cheap headphones that are comfortable but also sound really, really good. So I was wondering if the Taltronic active noise canceling headphones were gonna be the headphones that I've been looking for. Now I got these on Amazon for about $45 with the five or $10 coupon that I found on Engadget or Gizmodo, one of those websites. They were actually uh, recommending these headphones. So I said, you know what, maybe they're pretty good. Who knows, but I'll take their word for it. For $40, $45, I'll take the risk. I've spent more money on headphones before. Let's check it out. It's the Taltronic Active Noise Canceling Headphones. So now I've been using these for about a week now, but I wanna kinda show you guys uh, how they come in the box. It's really simple. It's just this really, uh, you know, standard gray box. And when you get it, they come in this nice little, you know, semi-hard uh, carrying case. So it's got a little bit of give to it, but you can tell it keeps it uh, safe inside. And when you take them out, uh, you know, first off, you got this little pouch, which is always good to have. And um, it comes with accessories. The accessories are a uh, adapter for when you take it on an airplane. It's also got the micro USB charging cord and also an auxiliary cable at 3.5 to 2.5, I believe, where if your Bluetooth goes out, you can still listen to your headphones. So this is what they look like. We're gonna take them out of the case, real simple like that. Now, the first thing you notice when you get these headphones is they're, it's a really simple design. I really like it, you know, black, got a little bit of a silver accent with the uh, Taltronic logo, but they're really light. Uh, one of the things I like about them is that when you uh, zoom in right here, uh, you can see that there's a little, maybe you can't see, but there's like little numbers right here. So a lot of times when you're adjusting your headphones and you're just kind of like going just a little bit, like how many clicks is that to make sure the other side is the same amount of clicks, but they put the numbers right there uh, to, to make it pretty easy on you. They also have, you know, all the little buttons. You have your power button, your charging uh, port, and then you have a uh, volume button that's a plus or minus. So if you want to um, uh, lower the volume with your headphones, you also have the, the little auxiliary input on this side and then the power button right there as well. One of the good things about these headphones is they are foldable. So you can uh, do like this and then you can fold them up to make them easily, uh, you know, if you wanna put them in your case or you just wanna throw them in your backpack, they can be folded really easily, so that's very nice. So when you see a lot of reviews on headphones, people wanna know if they're comfortable, and look how look how soft these are right here. I don't know if you can see that, but they're really, really soft. It feels like that, you know, fake leather, but, you know, it feels really good. Uh, the only problem with these types of ear cushions are they will get pretty hot around your ear, so they will get sweaty, so probably something you don't want to smell after a couple hours of use. Now I've been using these for about a week, so I want to tell you about the pros and cons of the Taltronics BH40s over the ear Bluetooth headphones. First off, the design. Like I said earlier, it's a very simple, sleek design. What I like about them is even though they got their logo right here, they don't scream, hey, look at me, I'm wearing Beats on my head. Look, Beats, everybody, Beats, Beats, Beats. You know, I think a lot of people will buy Beats uh, just to uh, for status, I guess. But uh, the Taltronics are simple. They're not screaming out loud, uh, telling you what they are because they're Taltronics. No one knows who that is to begin with. 
Also, like I said before, they're super lightweight. They're not heavy whatsoever, which feels really good on your head. Uh, I like the way they feel on my head. Uh, I think if they were heavier, it would weigh me down, but the way they're light feels really, really good. Um, the battery life is super long, 30 hours of battery life with these things. Uh, a lot of Bluetooth headphones, you might get anywhere from 10 hours to 15 to 20. These things last 30 hours, so no matter where you're going on an airplane, where you're going on the subway, you're gonna have a long time to use these batteries. One of the other things, the Bluetooth actually will stay connected to your phone or whatever for around 20 to 30 feet. In my house, I went from one side of the house to the other. It shows you how small my house is, but it never really messed up till I got about 25 feet, and that was between uh, a few walls. So the, the Bluetooth stays connected pretty well. And I would say the sound quality is pretty good. They're $40 headphones, so you're not gonna get the, the best headphones sound that you've ever looked for. But for $40, overall, it sounds pretty good. The clarity of the highs is real nice. Uh, you know, the, the mids are there. The bass is, it's a little lacking. I wanted a little more bass with these, but the good part is, like I said, it sounds overall really good. I listen to all types of music with these, whether it be rock, metal, classical, electronic, and it, and it really sounded good. Um, I wasn't expecting to be blown away by the sound, and when I listened to this, I'm like, you know what, this sounds like $40 headphones. Um, it's it's good, it's serviceable, it's what you would expect with the $40 headphones. If you're an audiophile, you're probably not gonna be in the market for $40 headphones. But overall, $40 headphones, I like the sound of it. The noise canceling with the headphones is also really uh, well done. A lot of times with cheap headphones, you're thinking, is the noise canceling gonna work? Yes, they do work. And also, a good part about the noise canceling, it doesn't really degrade the quality of the music or your listening experience that some headphones will do when you turn on the noise canceling. I like it, it cuts out the outside world, and uh, you know, for the most part, the sound, the noise canceling, all that is really good with these headphones. Okay, so let's talk about the cons of the Taltronic BH40s. Now, no matter how soft these ear pads are gonna be on any type of uh, over-the-ear headphones you get, Everyone will show you how soft they are and how great that is. But I have noticed out of probably 10 to 12 different over-the-air headphones I've uh, used in the past, over time, they will hurt your ears. Now, these ear cups are not huge. They do got a good, nice little oval to kind of put your ears inside, but they're not massive. So your ears do get squished a little bit. And over time, after about an hour and a half or two hours, you will feel your ears hurting from using these headphones. However, they are lightweight, like I said, and they have a lot of give. So if you're like me, you wear a hat a lot of times, you wear glasses. When you put them on, they are comfortable. So it's not going to really, uh, you know, compact your ears too much. But I would be lying to tell you that you will not fill these after some use. Like I said, about an hour and a half or two hours of use, your ears will start to hurt using these over-the-ear headphones and probably most over-the-ear headphones. It was real easy to connect my phone to these Bluetooth headphones. However, when I was playing music, sometimes I would get the Bluetooth kind of glitches, the pops in the sound. And I don't know if that was just an interference between the headphones and my iPhone, but there were those pops which can be annoying that I've had with other Bluetooth headphones. So I don't know if it's the headphones, if it's my iPhone, who knows what it is, but I did get some pops when connecting these and listening to music through these headphones. And that's pretty much it with the cons of the Taltronic BH40s. They have a lot of different models that are for sale on Amazon, but uh, the BH40s have the longest battery life, so if that's what you're looking for, check these out. The sound quality is good. They're good for $40. They're not gonna blow you away, but everything is clear, loud, no distortion. Uh, so I think you're gonna enjoy these Taltronic BH40s. Um, once again, if you're looking for headphones that are not going to ever hurt your ears, these are not it. I don't think any over the ear headphones are gonna be what you're looking for because not only are these have to be soft, but your ear will hit the little cushion inside where the speaker actually is and that's also what will weigh in on your ears and cause a little bit of discomfort over time. But for 40 bucks, man, these Taltronics are legit. I've been listening to them for over a week now. Uh, the sound is pretty good. They, they're comfortable, they're lightweight. They come with a great carrying case. Everything you need right there for $40. So I, I definitely recommend you picking up the Taltronic uh, BH40 Bluetooth active noise canceling headphones on Amazon. I'll put the link below if you want to check these out. Uh, so that's it for this rando review. I actually got another pair of headphones that uh, I got right after these, the Cowan E8s that I'm going to review next. So I'll kind of do a little 
uh, test between the two. Which ones do I like more? So check that out coming real soon on the channel. And like I said, make sure you hit that subscribe button below. We'll see you next time. Comment, like, all those things. And tell me what else you'd like me to review in the comments below. Uh, so we'll see you next time right here on Rando Reviews.